Welcome back to Drive World. And today I'm going to show you the fastest way to get to all the chocolate delivery locations. As you can see with this method, I've already been able to buy all the cosmetics and I have 1,500 chocolates left over. And I recommend grinding now because next week's rewards are going to be even more expensive than this week. Starting off with the first deliveries, we have all the ones up in Mountain Town. The first one we have is in this little parking lot. The second one is right in front of the gas station. The third one is in this green circle. And the last one is in front of this hotel. Luckily, a lot of these deliveries are clumped up together, so you don't have to learn many paths. And for all deliveries, you'll just want to go straight right. And then this is Mountain Town, so you want to go for another right. And you can see where it's at, and you'll just want to drive this way. And when you first start, you'll have a five second grace period where your chocolate won't melt. Once you're here, you're going to want to go up the mountain. And this method is also super easy because there's a whole bunch of chocolates you can collect. And if you miss the first turn, this is another way you can go. This way is only a few seconds slower, but it's honestly way more fun to do this path. And when starting out, your chocolate will have a health of 35. And hitting a fire will take down 3 health, and getting a chocolate will give you 8 health. And that's why it's worth it to go for this chocolate even if you hit that fireball. Next, we have the locations in the fall area. Instead of taking the turn like Mountain Town, just go straight onto the highway. If you have a fast enough car, you can make it across the entire bridge without having to collect any chocolate. And in this run, I did the faster method, but it's super risky. And it only saves about two seconds, so most of the time it's not really worth it. And here are all the locations of the deliveries. And here's the safer method. And now onto the next delivery location, we have a super rare one. This being the ending spot for the Race Lighthouse Trail and the start of Beacon Rally. I believe this is the fastest way to get there, but I'll show you another way which I think saves you more time. One of the problems with this path is once you reach the delivery spot, you won't have much chocolate. And here's another path which will give you more chocolate, but I still don't think it's the best. This is a method I go with because this delivery spot is super rare and it's always better to start right away going right. And this way you only lose like one or two seconds so it really doesn't matter. And I over jumped it here, so when you're doing it, make sure to slow down.
There's another super rare one, which I haven't been able to get on video, which is right here. And this is the path you want to take for it. And while you're on the bridge, you're going to want to look at drag strip and see if you can see the green circle next to the tower. And if it stays there, that means it's probably on the drag strip. And now onto possibly the best method. What you're gonna wanna do is open up the map and right after you wanna press F so you can open up the delivery menu. Once you do this, teleport to Mountain Town. But with this, I don't really think it's worth it to do the long deliveries. And here's one example why. They didn't expect people to start deliveries from here, so as you can see on this road, there's almost no chocolates. And this is how you're gonna want to do it. If you get a delivery that's longer than one mile, you're gonna want to cancel it and then start a new one. The developers also put a soft patch on this, which means you can't get the delivery in Mountain Town when you teleport to Mountain Town. As you can see here, I finally got one that's close enough, and this saves around 5 seconds. And here's another spot. This is the closest destination you can get from Mountain Town. And with that being said, I think that's going to be the end of this video. Let me know down in the comments if I missed any spots or if you have any other faster ways to get to these destinations. And I'll see you in the next video.